Back to part two of the exterior repaint project, guys. So what we did over there was we patched up. It was kind of beating up in this area, so we kind of fixed that up. And then right now we're moving along, priming all this. We got all that on the other side fixed up. Everything covered, mask. Color looks fantastic. Uh, we're also gonna be staining our fence and that's gonna be the last component. So you see guys on there, so that looks great. Moving along and hopefully we get wrapped up in the next couple of days with this project, so getting there. So for here, now we're getting ready to paint the porch. And the first thing we did, I actually went to go get a sander and sanded all the floor because it was kind of rough. So it's always nice to sand everything, try to get it to bare wood on there. So that's what we're going to start painting is the porch. I'm already finished with the ceiling, which came out fantastic. And then now we're going to do the porch. The product I like to use for the porch is called Sherwin-Williams Porch and Floor Enamel. Um, excellent for high tra traffic areas. So we're going to do all that painted using this product. So awesome. Can't wait to see how this turns out. It's going to be a brownish color anyway. So it's going to look really good. And here we go. station in the back very simple get everything covered cardboard on the bottom and now we're going to be spraying this back out here and we're done with this section uh this was one of the toughest parts to do due to the part that uh you had the neighbor side on this one so we have to protect all this and well we we got we got everything um covered in here so that way not, not, there's no overspray and then we have to spray all this we got pretty much all this done and you know my favorite part about painting is actually not the paint itself that's like the, you know, the easiest thing to do 
Okay, that usually goes pretty quickly. It's the masking. So when you mask really nicely, and you just pull, pull this up. I really love masking, and I always stress how important masking is to when we do a paint job. Why? Because it leaves these windows looking clean, very clean. And then usually what we also do at the end, we clean and wipe all the windows because they're kind of dirty with some Windex. So we leave these windows really clean, picture perfect clean. So my favorite part about a paint job is the masking. Because when you mask correctly, like I mentioned, you don't have to worry about spraying the windows. So I mask and I stress out of course of, of masking everything. That's how you can tell it's so good because you can't even take the paper out. And then we're gonna take a little knife, clean all that up, and then, like I said, masking. I like pulling this down. No spray on the window. We're still gonna clean all these. But yeah, that's how it is. Step-by-step -step process. We'll see you once we do the final finish line. We made it to the finish line here. So we're all completed and done. We're gonna go over just the project really quickly. I try not to speak a lot. I always try to. There's always a lot of things to explain, but we're finished and completed with this exterior repaint. First, we did the wall. Now we did the, the house. With the outdoor lighting, everything looks fantastic. Probably the next component that we're gonna do is probably the driveway. Maybe this year, if it's not this year, it's probably gonna be next year. So let me walk you through what we did. We stained the fence very nicely. Have you seen me there? Remember how the fence looked? It wasn't stained on there. So let me show you what we did over here. So we stained all this. And then back right the house. Same color, no trim, blue. Dark blue, navy blue from Sherman Williams. Emerald exterior paint. So if you guys want to come and see right here. On there, so. You guys can see looks great hard work paid off fantastic next up we're gonna show you the porch that's coming up so now we're in the portion which is my favorite personal favorite is the porch uh, Definitely worked hard on this section, but it overall it came out looking fantastic. So let me show you guys quickly and briefly. Um, so all this, if you remember, was just bare wood. We stained it using the same exterior stain. So that's what we got going on here leading up. And then the porch area. You guys wanna come in here, looks fantastic. Looks like the customer really set everything up. Chairs and a really nice setup here on the porch. And then the lighting, if you guys see the lighting there, really nice, gives it that nice feel. Very uh, rustic, you know, kind of that old, that nice feel. So the porch came out looking fantastic. Uh, painted the ceiling, all this. Probably, probably seen in that part of the video where we're painting all that. So that's the porch area. Uh, this came out looking fantastic. Kept the old numbers on there as well. Um, she had the option to replace maybe with uh, the newer type of material but she wanted to keep the older type so this looked great and awesome view of the porch yeah the chairs look fantastic and then the ceiling with the lighting oh this looks good very good briefly over here on this section we stained the fence very nice two-story house came out 
looking fantastic. So poor cherry is my favorite. It definitely came out looking really good. So that's it. That's FRC construction. And thanks for watching the first part. Yeah, the first part on there. This is the second, the conclusion.